Greetings, Benjamin J. from Ben's Trains with another in the series. Well, shooting this with a track camera, it's just easier. I just keep this thing uh, sitting here on the uh, layout table now. Anyway, this is the motor out of that uh, Lionel 8902, straight DC, as you see. So it went through my diodes. I'm out of diodes again. So I've taken two small diodes and uh, wired them in parallel, as you see. So this is now technically a straight AC motor. To test it, we're going to put it on the inside rail. This is that uh, de-rusted American Flyer track. You turn the power on, and this is a uh, connected to a 50 watt Marx transformer. Zoom, zoom, as you see, running on straight AC now. Well, running really well. So these CAN motors will not run on AC. Put it on an AC rail, just sit there and vibrate. It'll just burn the motor up. So you either run them on straight DC, or in this case, just add a, a diode directly to the motor, and you have an AC locomotive. This will run forever on AC. It'll still run on DC as well, but uh, it'll now run on AC, whereas it would not before. As you see, it's running absolutely perfectly. Total cost to do this is 20 cents, something like that. Uh, using these two little diodes, probably about a dime. And as you see, you just unsolder the power line going to the motor. It doesn't matter which side you use. It doesn't make any difference at all. And uh, in this case, I soldered two diodes and then soldered the uh, power wire directly to the end of the diodes. So, AC is converted to DC running the uh, CAN motor. And in this case, running it really, really well. This thing needs to be lubricated now that it's out and cleaned, of course. But the nice thing about it is it's up and running on AC. And the bulb was loose. It takes a really, really small screw-in bulb. Anyway, it was loose in the socket, so I got that tightened up. Anyway, I'll put a few drops of oil on this. It has a clean contactor. It only has one, but it's clean. So it is technically ready to go. I'll get this reassembled, and I have an AC locomotive. I still have to repair the shell. But anyway, I just wanted to do a quick video on this. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to drop me an email. Benstrains at gmail.com. And as always, thank you for watching.